and do it like this. Yes, <laughs> that right there, it's a little geode agate. Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my lapidary shop. Today I'm gonna to be cutting up in these agates from Mexico. They are agate, no way the agates. I have never ever cut open this variation of agates before and I'm gonna be cutting them open on my 10 inch high tech diamond saw and as a bonus, because we're cutting agates from Mexico open. I'm cutting open this little bag of Laguna agates at the very end. So I'm gonna fire my saw and we'll get to cutting and see what these agate Nueva agates are all about. We got our first cut done and I went with the geode agate here and I am very excited to see. Oh boy, it's kind of ghostly in there. Ghostly, beautiful white bands. We barely, barely <laughs> missed that geode pocket. I was trying to just catch it and I just missed it. Oh my gosh, you guys. Beautiful full pattern. Oh man. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at the beautiful staining in those fractures. Oh my gosh. I'm excited about this one. I think it's gonna have really nice white bands on the inside. Oh, it looks like it does. Let's do it like this. Oh, oh my gosh, just absolutely pure. And check this out, Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit more. Look at the depth. If you look beyond the bands inside of it, you can see how it, the banding and everything, mind the glare just shoots into that. That is so, so cool. Oh boy, that is crazy. This one is a really good show of the depth. I can't wait to see that one polished. That is very, very nice. So I am more than happy with how these agate and Nueva agates are turning out. We're gonna cut a few more of them here before we move on to the Laguna agates and this one right here is definitely one that I'm gonna be cutting. It looks really, really sweet. Um, I'm assuming there's gonna be quartz surrounded by bands. It's gonna be awesome. But before we do, I just wanna say I got all of these really cool agate Nueva agates from the gem shop. Big shout out to my friends over there. Golly, that looks cool. We'll cut that one too. Uh, but big shout out to my friends over at the gem shop. If you get stuff off their website, which is linked below, use code 5% off your order. So. Yeah, let's, ooh, that looks interesting. We'll try this one too. We'll cut these guys and then we'll move on to the Laguna agates. Let's see. <laughs> My gosh, look at that. That's really, really pretty. Holy moly, that is awesome. Man, I love Mexican agates. Ooh, that's, oh, it's got some amethyst in there. Just a tinge of amethyst on, I guess both sides, There's just a little bit in that quartz. How awesome is that? That is really cool. Holy moly, that is just so awesome. I love that.
<laughs> got halfway through the cut and I forgot to dress the blade with my little dressing stick. And I get a lot of people that ask where I get that from. I actually get it from High Tech Diamond, which is the same place that I get my saw from and the blades from. And again, same thing as the gem shop. All that's gonna be linked below with discount codes, it's the same thing. This one, I know a couple, couple things here. It felt really fast in through here. It's a lot thinner than up here, but my theory is that this is kind of gunky down here, maybe quartzy, and then there's more agate bands up here. That's my guess based on how it felt. And then um, that's just from cutting so many of these. And again, it might be because it's thin. I'm hoping I'm wrong and there's more bands. I think I'm wrong. Uh, there might be some quartz that kind of got a peek there, but let's just see the whole thing. Okay, <laughs> it's because there's a, ge <laughs> a geode. And what in the heck is that? Look at that beautiful little eye there. Man, oh man, that is so cool. We're going in. Look at that. Holy moly, what in the world? Well, it's like a little formation in there. That is crazy. That's so cool, little geodig. Nice little bands in there. Again, this one I think too, it does have a lot of fractures and stuff going on with it, but I think it's worth polishing. It's worth the trying, you know what I mean? It's better to try than to not. That's kind of my thing. I'd rather try and fail than not try at all. But anyway, this is really cool. We got one more cut, you guys. It's this guy, and I'm racking my brain on where in the world do I cut it. We got a full pattern right there. It'd probably take a while, but I think we should cut it through here. That'd probably make a lot of people happy instead of going <laughs> through there. So it's probably gonna take like three, four minutes to cut it through there. All right, make your guesses now. What's inside? I bet there's Jasper inside. <laughs> that was lame. All right, let's see what's inside this. Woo oh my gosh. Hey, there's a T for Taylor. That was made for me. <laughs> Thank you. That is so cool. Holy moly. That is, <laughs> that's really, really sweet. And we'll zoom in and see if it works here. Man, what a great way to end the Agate Nueva Agates with this glorious salmon -y and white lavender. It's sweet either way. And a tea. The tea for me. Here are our four ooh, Laguna Agates. This guy looks like it's gonna have beautiful bands. This guy has beautiful bands. I don't even wanna cut that. That is so pretty. Maybe we'll just cut the butt off of it. We'll just cut the butt. And then this guy, I don't honestly know where to cut it. I think I'll just go in through here and hopefully we'll get kind of like a funky, I don't know. Moving on. Yeah, this guy, beautiful bands. Hopefully full pattern red in there. So we'll cut through these and then we'll look at them as we cut them. Ready for the super band show? <laughs> oh boy, man, the parallax banding in that. Holy moly, that's one of the, my, I will say, favorite things about Laguna agates. The shadow banding that you can get with them is unbelievable. Right down by my thumb. That is crazy up here. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. It makes me so happy. Man alive. Love how it just comes up and through here. Oh yeah. Wow. Not sure what to expect with this <laughs> other than bands. <laughs> oh yeah, that is cool. I love getting Stuff like this where you can polish this, we get a nice, you know, rounded face polish here. And then you can see the rough face on it as well and how the bands just flow into that. I think it makes for a very, very cool display piece. And those bands, yellow, blue, little, maybe a little dark 
black, a little hints of it in there, white. This is awesome. So I got a little breakage on that one, a huge chunk of, well, it was obviously fractured, broke off. So I don't think this one's gonna be as good as I hoped. I think it just has a really nice window on it. Yeah, it comes down and through there. That is really pretty, but golly, it's just like, you think about, if you're into polishing and stuff, and I'm really into it, I love it. You try to polish something like this, it's like you're just asking for, you get to the end and it's like scratch, scratch, scratch. You just, it actually can be kind of a nightmare. And this would be something that might be worth like, I don't know if you can soak it in something and get it all, all this stuff off. But I have a Malawi agate that's got some of this natural matrix on it. And I have polished it through the final polish like seven times. And I still can't get the scratches out. So I just start over. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to rinse my hands off and we'll cut our last Laguna agate. <laughs> so excited for this one. Caught it exactly where I wanted it, kind of through this window, through here, and I think it's just gonna be kind of like that very first one we cut, just like that. I think it's gonna look really, really sweet. Let's see. Oh, I wanna do it like this. Oh, yes. <laughs> that right there, it's a little geode agate. Holy moly, we got Beautiful bands with parallax banding in there. That is so cool. This dark stuff down in here, it's like uh, surface fractures and stuff for myself. That'll all be worked out. I think this one is pretty much, I won't say perfect. I got some fractures around the outside, but it's, it's pretty great. <laughs> it's so good with those parallax banding. Oh man, look at it dance. Holy Toledo, that is sweet. So cool, man. You guys will have to let me know. Did you guys like the Laguna agates more or were you more of like an Agate Nueva fan? I know they're, they're a little bit different. They're similar if they're from the same country and stuff, but let me know what you guys thought. I thought it was really fun being able to cut both variations for Mexico. Well, thank you all so much for joining me on this very fun cutting adventure. As always, I had so much fun. Cutting agates makes me so happy. They're a mystery to see what is inside and we get to cut them open. We're the first ones to get to do it and I love sharing it with all of you. Thank you all so much for taking the time to watch this. If you liked it, leave a thumbs up and make sure you hit that subscribe or follow button so you don't miss any more very fun videos. We have a lot of stuff to cut. It's gonna be a blast. We'll see you next time, bye.